Good morning, gorgeous ones. How are we? Uh, <laughs> I've positioned it this way this morning so that you can see my plants because that was one of my joys from Monday. Uh, well, it's actually Sunday, but uh, my talk on Monday was about simple things and the power of being outside and the power of plants for our good mood. So this week's topic is all about simple things. Morning, everybody. Gorgeous ones. Good morning, all. Um, I didn't do a post yesterday because in Victoria it was Melbourne. Well, actually in Melbourne, it was Melbourne Cup Day and it was a public holiday. And, you know, I'm a bit of a workaholic and I thought I just need to actually stop for one day. So I did. Um, but today, today I'm talking about automating things. So as you know, Mary and I are not, we're not super business savvy. We, we don't know anything about business really. And we've been, we have a coach who helps us. So my big thing is always, whenever you don't do, you know, you don't know things, get help. That's, that's the takeaway from that. But in business, I talk about automating things. And I like to talk about automating things in life. Now, the reason that we want to automate things in life is because it takes us out of our head and it just automatically gets done. And what that does is that reduces our stress load and it means that we don't have to keep thinking of things. And this came about this morning because my husband says, we've only got one roll of toilet paper left. And I go, that's okay. The toilet paper delivery is coming today. So I have automated lots of different things in my life that are crucial. So, you know, it, and it's interesting to look. So what are the things that would give the most stress if they, if they weren't there? So pet food, you know, if you've got nothing to feed your pets, that's pretty stressful. Toilet paper. We all know the great toilet paper grab of COVID. Um, for me, contact lenses, prescriptions, anything that is sort of time critical. If you can, automate it so that it just arrives you don't have to think about it i've now got all my bills are automated so that you know um telstra bill it gets automated so you know i still look at it to make sure that there's no external things but it's not time critical i used to go oh, yeah, i look at that and then just never do it um or i'd look at it and i'd be looking at it at a time where i couldn't address it so it might be you know suddenly the email comes in and i go oh that's nice and then I put it down completely, forget about it. But once it's automated, I don't have to think about it. And that reduces my overall stress load. So um, one of the things I'd love you guys to do today then is have a do a little mini audit. Is there something in your life that you can just automate it? Maybe it's a vegetable delivery. Um, maybe it's a meat, a meat delivery. Maybe it's contact lenses. All of those things taken off my plate make my stress level lower and as you know stress stress is is not good for humans uh, and it is a uh, thing that increases our fat storage through cortisol but it's also a thing that adds to our load where we talk about that thing of too much on your plate now you know we love word play so too much on your plate i mean why is it called that it's not called it's not called and i say this many times when we're stressed, it's called too much on your plate. It's not called too many cars in the car park or too many shoes on my shoe rack. Sometimes it's called balls in the air, but a lot of the time it's too much on your plate. So take something off and that's your job today. Automate something and then you'll feel a whole heap better and have a bit more capacity to look after yourselves. All right, beautiful peeps. Have a wonderful day. Go and put your feet in the grass if you can. I did it on Monday again. I love it. Love, love, love it. Um, and go and find something to automate. Bye darlings.